good. You stopped before the white light. Beautiful. I mean, the white line. I'm a god. You know. Look, you know I'm a senior citizen, man. Come on now. You know I meant the white line in the street. So how long have you had your learner's permit? For about four months. Four months? Or three months, yeah. Okay, and how many times have you went on a road test like this? Um, I had like probably 20 lessons. 20 lessons? Yeah. Oh, how you think you did? I did pretty good. Oh, okay. Well, we're going to see about that. Speed limit on this street? Probably about 30, so I'm going on average. Uh, how would you know that? It's the average speed limit on most roads. Well, still, how would you verify that? I would look at the speed limit sign. Okay, I haven't seen one yet, have you? No. Oh, so you just assume it's 30? Okay, well, we'll see. Hopefully, that's the case. Okay, you got to take your next left that you can turn left. Take your next available left. Oh, wait, wait. You can't just... Okay, pull over here a minute. Before you take a left, you have to actually slow down and take the left with caution because it could have been a car coming up the street and you took it without stepping on the brakes is a problem, all right? All right, so we're gonna go down here a little ways, halfway on the street, I'll tell you when, and we're gonna do a three-point turn. Oh. You know how to do one of those? Okay. All right, you're gonna pull over to the right of the uh, street here. Excuse me. We're going to pull over to the right of the street. Okay. Now there's a, a, a driveway there. You think that'll be good for you? Yeah. Okay. Stop. Now you is going to uh, do a turn without a signal, right? You have to have a signal on and you have to check stop stop and you have to check all mirrors before you move okay check the mirrors okay you got a rear mirror here pull all the way in no nope. you're gonna pull all the way in go ahead go right on in go right on in no, no. The instructions was to go on in. Right. Okay. So when you do your turn, you want to pull your rear end as, in as much as possible so that when you back up, you have enough room to go back without it being a problem. Okay. So you're going to... Um, so just so you know, we're going to your left. Okay. Okay. Stop. You always turn your wheel before you start moving. Because if you don't, you gotta now back in again and do that again. Right? Okay, so let's back in again. Go on in. Go on in. Okay. Now, you're gonna turn your wheel first before you move. No, we're turning the wheel first before we move. Hello? Okay. Did I turn it? Yeah, but you was moving. You want to completely turn your wheel before you move. Okay. And and look at this right side. Excuse me, you never looked at the right side. I just did, Grandma. No, no ma'am. Grandma, for real, I just did. No, ma'am. I did. I looked, you didn't see no, me. No, ma'am. Excuse me. Excuse me.
me. Now we're gonna look at both mirrors and then we're gonna back out. At the end of the street, you're gonna take a left. Sometimes if you just wait when you're not sure because then you're not trying to break through real quick and worry about, you know, an accident. Okay. So what does it mean when it's a, a double yellow line in the street like that? It means, um, oh my gosh, opposite traffic, like the traffic goes both ways. Yes. Very good. And a yellow, I mean a white, means same traffic direction. Same goes in the same direction. Okay. She found the speed limit. That's beautiful. No, slow down on the tracks. That's what I was just doing. Yeah. Because if you don't, sometimes they're pretty messed up and you know, your car can really hit some bumps. This tire can make some money. I'm sorry. Okay, so now we're gonna try to find a place for you to park. How you? How are you at parking? I do good at my parallel parks, but I okay. do really bad at regular parking. Okay. So at the corner here, we're gonna take this left. Left, right, uh, We are gonna go. Let's take a left because I don't see where we have some cars on the street already parked. Pedestrians. Slow down and stay to the left. Well, they're all over the place. Let me go in the middle. Take a right at the corner. Across instead of taking the right, it looks like I see two cars that are parked um, one in front of the other, and you can try your parking there. Pull up some so you can clearly see all avenues. Great job. cars are not uh, close enough because of the driveway. I want you to go um, down to the, yes. I never parallel parked between two cars. I only parallel parked behind their car like that. All right, we can try that today then since oh. you never did it. Grandma, I don't feel comfortable with that. Well, you know, you have to, you're, you're driving now, right? Yeah, I know, but it's you want your license? Well, you want to try? Nothing beats a failure, but a try. I think you can right do it. Right. You're way out. Okay, listen. You have to listen to instructions, okay? Don't keep going, else this, this lesson will have to end. You, well, you can't, you can't turn bit. into, no, but listen, you can't turn into the other lane because, you know, this is your lane, right? Okay? So you gotta turn sharper so that you stay in your lane, okay? Okay. 
Seems like we're not gonna be able to find two cars together right now. So we're gonna go to the end here and take a left. <coughs> Excuse me, I never yelled yet, okay? You don't want really want me to really yell, do you now? Okay, you can take a lap. How much are these condos going for? I don't know, look nice. So sometimes you'll be going, I don't know, 35, and then it'll drop down to 30. So that's really important to once in a while make sure that you're seeing what the speed limit is. Oh, children. Oh, we were in the hall. No, you weren't. to turn safely okay and the other thing is when you're turning you know you have to decide whether you need to lead the wheel straight or do you turn the wheel as you're moving back okay because remember when we did we was trying to park and you crossed the whole street twice yeah okay that was strictly because you didn't uh, adjust your your driving so like for instance when you drove a little bit then you sh you should have said okay it's time for me to start turning the wheel in to straighten the car up so that's how come it ended up crossing the street like this versus going in at some point you gotta start adjustments to straighten the car up to go where you want it to go into that spot okay all right so we're good Love you. No. Kiss, kiss, kiss. Oh. Oh. Yes. Thank you. You know Darius is recording. Of course I know he is. He's too much. <laughs>